Hi everyone, Missy G here. I am currently in my bed, and why? Because I can. It's just feeling like that kind of a day. But uh, this weekend, the wedding odyssey, I had so much fun. Um, never done anything like that before, never crossed my mind to do anything like that before, but getting out of my box, I ended up contacting the organizer and she ended up finding space for me. Um, the first show on Saturday was a shit show. I actually called it the train wreck and thankfully all of us survived. Some of us not unscathed, moi included. But uh, the second, third, and fourth show, everyone was, you know, they got over their nerves and it went so fantastic. I was strutting my stuff on the second day. I was just having a ball. Um, I hope to do it again next year. I just, I just had so much fun. Um, and coincidentally, the black dress that um, I wore, my absolute, absolute favorite, got it from Salon Obsession by Joseph in Windsor, Ontario. Um, he is allowing me to purchase that dress for the Miss Canada tourism pageant. That's going to be my pageant dress. So I'm so excited. I'm going to be buying that later on this afternoon. And uh, yeah, great things are coming to me. I will let you guys know all about it, but some great things happened outside of that. So I'll let you know as soon as uh, things start rolling. But on to other news here, what I want to talk to you about. I have some more questions. Um, the questions that some of you sent a few months ago, I had yet to still get to. So these are the last remaining ones. So I'm going to get started on them. Hugh asks, will you marry me? Well, Hugh, I do apologize. Um, sorry, guys, there. I do apologize, but you got to get in line. Um, very... Out I, I don't even know why this happened, but uh, once I started posting photos of the fashion show, uh, my Facebook and my text messages have just been going off. It's like, oh yeah, Missy G. She's kind of hot. So, unfortunately, you, you got to get in line, but I'm really enjoying this whole harem of men thing that's happening right now. And unfortunately, I may be choosing my would-be male suitor the way that Emperor Cusco did in The Emperor's New Groove. Not that one, not that one. Let me guess, you have a great personality. Yeah. Hate your hair, not likely. Yikes, yikes, yikes. And let me guess, you have a great personality. But I am really enjoying this whole harem of male suitors thing. It's totally awesome. Jeremy Kirkpatrick, why is the sky blue? Well, Jeremy, my philosophy is that there are a billion mini, teeny, tiny Smurfs up there. Just suspended in the air. Doing Smurf things like what Smurfs do. Um, that's my philosophy anyways. Other people can counteract that. I have no idea, but that's my belief system. Justin Blanco. Battlefield or COD? And let me tell you, it took me at least a good two minutes to figure out what you meant by COD. So clearly, neither of them. I'm not a gamer. But if you did ask me, do you like Super Mario Kart? I would say, hells yeah. That was my favorite game growing up. And in fact, I think it was like the new Sega that came out or something along those lines. New Nintendo. I don't even know. The one after Nintendo 64, I'm pretty sure, um, where you actually had the steering wheel. And yes, I'm actually doing the steering wheel move right here. And it set up wirelessly to your system. And it was just awesome. It was like you're driving in your living room. And you're Yoshi. I do that game. Kevin Ballard. I see you love wearing bikinis. Where is your favorite beach located? And why is it your favorite? Unfortunately, around where I live, there's not too many beaches. The one in my city is um, shit, to say the least. Um, I do have to drive about 45 minutes to an hour away in a cute little town um, called Leamington. So it orbs. And actually, it got hit by a tornado about four or five years ago, give or take. And uh, the town really worked hard at restoring it. And it's actually better than what it was. Beautiful sand, beautiful waters. Uh, the town is so cute. 
but unfortunately it's 45 minutes to about an hour away. And then as I did last year, I absolutely love Port Stanley. It's a huge beach. Um, just the atmosphere of it all is fantastic. And then on the other side of Port Stanley is actually Grand Bend, where a lot of uh, high school students and uh, college students from around here go for the May 2-4 weekend and every weekend in the summer. Those two are fantastic, but it's like a good two-hour drive away for both of them. So, yeah, that's all I got around here, unfortunately. Will Jones. Say, Missy G, when are you going to let me take you out on a date? Well, Will, you got to come here. It's winter out. I don't drive in the winter. I do drive, but not in the winter. I hate the winter. In fact, anything below 70 degrees Fahrenheit is way too cold for me. So clearly this is my hibernation period. I'm not going to be sexy until May. So you're just going to have to come here. I'm sorry to say that, but I'm really not. And finally, Reno C. Can you make a video doing squats? Well, Reno, I think I did. If you look back in my other YouTube videos, the very beginning when I first started making YouTube videos, I was doing workout videos. Pretty sure I did one with a squat. Can't recall off the top of my head. But if I didn't, I will be sure to do one for you and subsequently everybody else that enjoys me doing squats. So those are all the questions that have come in thus far. Please keep asking them. I know it's been a few weeks, but I'm back on board. Send in your questions and I will for sure, for sure answer them. Other than that, love you guys. Thank you for all the support and I will talk to you later. Bye.